Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amit. Today we are going to answer this question. Name few of the tasks those are available to create a maintenance plan or those can perform DBA tasks such as create indexes, take backup, etc. in SSIS package. So let's go to the SSDT or bids and see what we have here. So if I see on the common, I do not see anything uh, related to the DBA tasks such as taking backup, create indexes uh, or statistics update. Uh, then we go to containers. I do not see anything related to DBS as well. We have a for loop container for each loop container, sequence container, and all that. But just at the look at the names, we can't really say that those are DBA tasks. Uh, you know, here in the other task, we have a list of the tasks. Those are the DBS task. So let's take a look on uh, some of them and uh, see what the DBS can do or a developer can create a package for the DBS and uh, that will perform different things for them. So what we have here, we have a backup database task that can be used to take the backup, full backup, uh, uh, transactional log backup or, or differential backups. And we have a check data, database integrity task. We have a execute a SQL Server agent job task. We have execute SQL statement that can, that's pretty much same uh, what we have execute SQL task. And um, uh, th th this is a um, task that the DBS can use to run their T SQL statements. Uh, we have history cleanup task uh, that can be used to delete the history. And uh, we have rebuild indexes, reorganize indexes, shrink databases, transfer database tasks. So there are tons of uh, tasks. Those are only available for the DBAs and especially DBA tasks. So we, we as a developer, we can also use them, you know, in our SSIS packages if they are required. But most of the time, these are the tasks the DBAs will use and they will create the uh, SSIS package for their maintenance or they will uh, use uh, to create the backup plans and all that. They, when they go to maintenance plan in the um, SSMS, and let's go to the SSMS and see what they have here. And now we have a management. And in the management, we have a policy. And here we see the maintenance plan. If we click on maintenance plan, we can create a new maintenance plan. So when you create a new maintenance plan, okay, uh, agent XP components turn off as a part of the security configuration or system. Okay, so in my case, uh, uh, some server setting has to be done but if you create a new maintenance plan what's going to happen um, or you can use the maintenance plan wizard uh, what, what is going to happen you will see all those tasks what you are seeing right now in the um, SSDT or bids and uh, they can drag and drop and create their uh, maintenance plan uh, on the back end what's going to happen it's going to create an SSIS package that will be used in their maintenance plan so this is pretty much it for uh, this video and I will see you next video.